prepare to have your mind blown and your heart wrenched as we take you through 30 bear encounters. From massive grizzlies climbing into cars to black bears charging people, these encounters are not for the faint of heart, showing us exactly why you should not mess with these beasts in the wild. Witness a truly horrific moment as a woman in Alberta discovers not one but three grizzly bears. And to make matters worse, her dogs are out there growling at the beasts as well. Oh, come here, come here! Hello? Hello, Bruce, we have three young grizzlies in our yard right now! The woman and her dogs were about to go back into the house after watering the garden. When the grizzlies invaded and started eating dog food from the shed, it was a life or death situation as she called her partner and tried to wrangle her dogs up. To the root cellar, two of them are in the root cellar right now eating the dog food. I try, but they won't listen to me. The bears weren't particularly aggressive and were only there for food. But all that could have easily changed in the blink of an eye as the dogs refused to back off and kept running at the beasts. They won't listen to me. I tried to get him up on the top deck to bring him in, but Teddy just won't listen. In the end, her partner told her to grab the gun and defend herself, and that's exactly what she did. However, she later told emergency services that her scare shots didn't exactly work on the bears. Yeah, they're coming. They're going to come after the dogs. Yes, I gotta get the gun. Okay, okay. Grizzly bears are not afraid of humans and will absolutely shred you to bits in the wild just to get some food. So when a bear shows up at a hunter's camp, it turns into a game of chess between them. Bears are deceptively resilient, which means that even though the hunter's got a rifle, he could still get mauled after taking a shot. It's a precarious situation, and he's going to have to be very careful. The hunter aims at the bear, ready to shoot if the beast tries anything. However, the bear isn't going to back down, and now a clash is inevitable. <laughs> It all kicks off as the hunter fires a warning shot right next to the bear, making it retreat into the woods. This is the best outcome, as everyone comes out of the predicament unscathed. If there's one thing you definitely shouldn't do around a wild bear, it's trying to antagonize it further by making fun of it. This man is playing with fire by walking up to the bear and barking at it. Not to mention that it's an open area so the bear can close him down within seconds, making him regret every single choice that's led to this moment. The bear isn't going to allow this mockery. And so just when the guy thinks he's in the clear, the beast springs into action, chasing him down as he frantically stumbles back to the safety of his car. Lesson learned. Living in the woods is not for the faint of heart, because you never know when you'll get an unexpected visitor at your house. Black Bear is curious about the car parked in front of the house, checking if there's any food inside. But while you'd usually expect a beast like this to walk away after taking a peek, this bear does the unthinkable. The bear is inside the car, and the owner has no clue that it's there. She's about to walk up to her car, unaware of the horror that awaits her. Ah! 
As expected, she's not enthused to see the bear sitting in the driver's seat, but what's more incredible is that she tries to out-muscle the beast and lock it inside, a decision she definitely comes to regret. At least the bear got some fruit to munch on. A lot of people underestimate bears in the wild, because with their size, they don't look like the quickest animals in the world. However, this man is about to find out exactly why you should never mess with them. He has stumbled upon three bears, and rather than running for his life, he decides to walk closer and provoke them, which, as he is about to discover, is a really bad idea. The bear goes from standstill to a full sprint in the blink of an eye, with the man scrambling his way back to the car. And sure, he may have gotten back safely, but he has been utterly humiliated by the bear, and won't be repeating that mistake. Going to a national park with the family is always a fun experience, and that's the case for these folks as well, because a massive bear has just taken a liking to their rental car. <laughs> They're having the time of their lives watching that bear cuddle up to their car. And to be fair, the beast does look adorable. Well, that is until he decides to move closer and show this family his more dangerous side. Hey, Mr. Bear. <gasps> no, he's gonna break it! Uh, whoa! That's not good. Oh. Oh. The bear unleashes its strength and breaks the car's side mirror in one fell swoop, sucking the fun out of this family's holiday. They'll think twice about laughing at a bear approaching their car now. Glenn! Glenn! Oh, go! 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 go, go. Evil bear! <laughs> in Tennessee, a man struggles to get his car door open, but he's also being extremely careful. After all, this isn't an everyday situation, and he's about to be greeted by something truly petrifying. There's a massive bear inside his car, and the man needs to make sure he lets the beast out without any confrontation, something that's never guaranteed in these encounters. Go on. Go! Ah! The bear looks confused and doesn't know what's happening, and even though the man's trying to shoo him away, it's not working. But thankfully, Lady Luck is on their side, and the bear does listen eventually. Go on. Go. Ah! Go. Go. Ah! Go. Go. Despite their ferocious nature, bears are also some of the smartest animals you'll encounter in the wild, so much so that they can actually open doors. Seeing a bear walk up to your house and open the front door has to be one of the most terrifying sights in the world. What do you even do in this situation? Do you run over to the door or hide yourself in a closet? The person filming knows exactly how to deal with the predicament, staying calm and distracting the bear with thumps on the window. However, the danger hasn't fully subsided yet because the other bear wants a peek as well. <laughs> Luckily, the other bear isn't a door-opening expert. Tourists often underestimate bears' ability to be deadly, stopping by to take photos. But if there's one thing we've learned so far, it's that these beasts are not to be messed with, even if you're in a car. <laughs> Who is that? The tourists stop to record a black bear, which doesn't look very friendly. The bear is keeping its distance, trying to remain hidden behind the grass. Yeah, okay, 
Tourists aren't happy with the photos they've taken, though, and want to invade the bear's personal space for a closer look, which, as they soon come to realize, is a grave mistake. In Colorado, a man sits in the back of his truck, lost in thought about something, but even though he thinks he's safe in his home, an unwelcome guest turns up to give him a terrifying surprise. It's a bear, and it's desperate for some snacks, so much so that it's managed to sneak its way into the house without the man noticing. And with his back turned to the beast, there's no way he can prevent an attack either. There are only two outcomes here. Either the bear obliterates the guy, or something miraculous happens and the man escapes the encounter unscathed. But one thing's for sure, it's all about to kick off. Speaking of bears invading homes, witness an incredible scene as multiple bears enter a holiday retreat, scrounging around for food around the cabins as people watch in awe from the top. That's the third one. The bear cubs seem pretty harmless as they climb into the backs of people's trucks and look for food. Besides, the tourists appear to be enjoying the show as well. Oh, it's up there. <laughs> but while it's all fun and games, watching bears roam around the area, things are eventually bound to get serious. After all, as we've learned, some bears can open doors and, well, let's just say these bears are particularly skilled at that. Oh my God. The man is fearless and somehow manages to make the bear flee, allowing him to lock the door. But even though he's dealt with the beast attacking his car, there's another truck nearby, which also happens to be unlocked. He opened it. <laughs> Always lock your doors around bears. What would you do if you found out that a bear had made its way into your vehicle? Well, this guy thinks he's conjured up the perfect solution. Ropes. You don't want to be anywhere near an angry bear, which is why this idea sounds genius. After all, when you're 20 meters away, hiding behind a tree, there's no way the bear could get to you after escaping, right? It's an amazing scene as the door opens up with ease, using the rope, letting the bear out safely. Perhaps more people should take note and start using this method, or, well, keep their cars locked in the first place. In another case of bears being incredibly smart, this big guy also thinks it can open the door and look for snacks inside. The only problem? There are people nearby who won't let this bear get in so easily. Without a lock, the bear opens the car door with ease. However, the people filming the incident know exactly what they're doing because they've got the perfect plan for how to deal with this hungry animal. Honk, 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 honk the horn. To be fair, the bear could have easily ignored the honks and climbed inside the car anyway. But the beast is not in the mood for confrontation and will instead search for another unattended car it could steal from. Deep in the jungle, a man encounters a massive brown bear heading towards him. Rather than losing his calm and running away, however, the man decides to stand his ground against the beast instead. 
Миша, вот что ты лезешь, а? Что ты сюда лезешь? The bear stops in its tracks as soon as it spots the man, turning the encounter into a staring contest. The next few seconds are crucial here because the bear could absolutely charge the man and destroy him if it wanted to. Сколько тебе говорить, что тебя сюда не звали? Но ты опять лезешь и лезешь. This isn't the man's first bear encounter though, when he's come fully equipped to deal with such dangers in the forest. So he takes out something that's surely going to send the beast running back. A bear banger. Ходи, Миша. In one of the most terrifying bear encounters ever recorded, a man wakes up to the sound of a bear growling outside his tent. And just when he reaches for the flap to take a peek, he gets greeted by the ferocious beast. Bear doesn't look in a great mood, and the man stuck inside his tent with almost zero protection. His life is in danger, but that's just the beginning because the bear isn't just going to stand there and growl, he's gonna attack too. <laughs> it all kicks off as the bear starts clawing at the tent with the man screaming helplessly. What makes this situation even more dangerous, though, is the fact that the flap is still half open. In what can only be considered a miracle, the bear stops the assault after a while and retreats, letting the poor camper live to tell the tale. People say that Russians are a different breed, and to be fair, there is some truth to that. Seriously, just look at this guy in Kamchatka, hanging around and feeding a brown bear like it's nothing. Of course, that doesn't mean the bear is going to stop behaving like one. In fact, if anything, this bear seems to be losing its patience because it wants more snacks. That said, the man's response to the bear's aggression is even more impressive. Anuka. Coastal brown bears are some of the biggest bears you'll see in the wild, weighing as much as 1,200 pounds, 540 kilograms. And if one of these bad boys shows up at your front door, you're basically screwed. This bear is not here to make friends and is putting its front paws down as a warning, telling people not to mess with it. That said, when the tourists don't heed its warning, the beast decides to take things up a notch. Witness this utterly nerve-wracking scene as a massive black bear walks out of the woods. The people recording are scared for their lives, so much so that they're telling their little girl to stay quiet. What makes this encounter more dangerous, though, is the fact that the bear's with its cub. And if there's one thing we've learned about mama bears, it's that they don't like anyone getting close to their children. There's another cub. With the bear approaching the car with its cub, there's no way it won't think of the tourists as a threat. And that, of course, means there's only going to be one outcome here. Bears opening car doors is one thing, but this big guy in New Jersey took things to another level by attempting to open a massive garage door. It's a bizarre situation because the owner can't do anything but watch helplessly as the bear tries to get into her house. And to make matters worse, her kids are also stuck inside. Tell the kids to knock them out of the house. The bear's in the garage. Literally, the bear's in the garage. Yes. 
After many attempts, the bear finally manages to get the garage door fully open. What it does after that, however, might surprise you. Rather than going inside and looking for some actual snacks, the bear's taken a liking to the trash can. And now it's gonna take its sweet time eating all the garbage inside and making a mess. <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> oh, no! Come on! <laughs> Sometimes people come up with the most creative ways to tackle problems. This, for instance, is a massive bear trap prepared to capture a beast that's been terrorizing the nearby town. And while it may look dodgy, it's actually surprisingly effective. The bear's greed has led to its capture, and now it's not happy about being caged. People who've caught it, on the other hand, are rejoicing because it's not like you catch a bear every day, is it? <laughs> but as we've learned, a door isn't enough to hold back a bear, and even though these people are happy, their whole plan is about to go wrong. <laughs> Over in Florida, a man desperately tries to save his little dog as it tries to take on a bear that's managed to climb on top of the fence in the backyard. The bear's just standing there as the dog barks at him, and even the man's attempts to scare it away aren't working. With the bear perched on the fence, there are only two ways. It comes inside and starts attacking the dog and its owner, or slowly backs off. And lucky for the man, the beast chooses the latter. Imagine this. You're on a camping trip, and one fine morning you wake up to the sound of some strange growls. You peek outside your tent, and lo and behold, a gigantic bear is standing there looking for food. What do you do in that situation? Well, according to this camper who's experiencing this exact scenario, you try to remain calm and not engage with the bear, which, let's be fair, does seem like a sound strategy. The only issue here is that if the bear realizes there's someone in the tent, it's basically game over. Thankfully, this guy's tent is camouflaged pretty well, so he can just tuck back inside and wait for the beast to go away. Sometimes bears need help, too. This beast, for instance, has gotten itself stuck in a leg hold trap, and no matter how hard it tries, it can't get out. Kicked out of that trap. So, I'm not happy I'm here. I'm not happy it's there, so. Good. The trap belongs to the man recording, but he didn't actually want to capture the bear. Instead, he's just going to try and let the bear go, which is not going to be easy at all. Of course, making the bear trust him with the process is the most difficult part, because a trapped bear will be aggressive no matter what you do. That said, the man knows exactly what he's doing and handles the situation expertly. After some bouts of struggle, he finally manages to disarm the trap and let the bear roam free. good. 
Here's another case of bears being incredibly smart, with the beast slowly walking up to a car as its owner watches from a distance, praying that the bear doesn't scratch his car. Of course, we know how good bears are at opening doors, so this shouldn't come as a surprise. What is fascinating, however, is the bear's reaction once it hears the people screaming at it. The bear is absolutely perplexed, standing upright on its legs and slowly walking backward, almost as if it's scared. Who would have thought screaming worked on bears, huh? Over in Yellowstone National Park, a bear roams freely near the road as a ranger yells at people, telling them to get inside their car. Tourists don't realize that even though the bear doesn't seem aggressive and is just passing by, all that could change in the blink of an eye. Seriously, you can never be too careful around these absolute freaks of nature. If you spot a bear in the wild, following it and trying to befriend it is probably not the wisest of ideas. And yet that's exactly what this man's about to attempt here. In a world where most people would run away, even the bear is confused to see a person approaching it so nonchalantly. In fact, the beast is so surprised it gets up and prepares itself for things to kick off. There's got to be some sort of strange aura coming from the man recording, though, because as he gets closer, he somehow manages to be the dominant one. How would you react if you saw a massive black bear walking towards your car in a national park? Well, these tourists are experiencing that and they can't believe their luck. The bear's minding its own business and probably just wants to cross the road in peace. The tourists, however, keep exclaiming at the beast, something that could potentially antagonize it. Thankfully, they're shushed before the bear can notice and everyone's safe as it walks off into the distance. Witness an absolutely crazy scene from the late 90s as a gigantic black bear tries to break its way into a car in Great Smoky Mountains National Park. The bear's terrifying, but the tourists don't seem to care as they line up to take photos. However, it's not going to take long for them to realize why they should stay away from such an enormous creature. Oh, I'm sorry. After breaking the window, the beast squeezes its way inside the car and starts looking for food as tourists watch in awe from a distance. If that's not shocking enough, the bear takes things to another level by making itself at home inside the car. <laughs> what would you do if a bear showed up at your front door? Well, this guy thinks telling it to go away is good enough, which of course is never going to work. Go away, bear. The bear seems to have taken a liking to the ground next to the rental cabin, refusing to go back. So now the tourists have to figure out how to make this big boy move. 
We don't have any. We don't, he's not coming in the house. We don't have any right here. He's just sitting chilling. The bear's not here to fight, though. If anything, it's used to seeing people around the area and casually walks through as if nothing's bothering it, so a potentially terrifying encounter turns into a great experience for the tourists. But here's our bear, and he's just rooting around, <laughs> eating. Now here's a father-son duo that was out collecting resin when they stumbled upon a young bear. <laughs> Apparently the bear's den is nearby and it has only come out because these folks have disturbed it. They're not phased by it one bit though and keep looking at it like it's not dangerous at all. <laughs> Of course, being near a bear cub is probably one of the most dangerous things you could do in the wild. After all, you never know when a mother bear could pounce on you to protect her cub.